Hey guys, I saw this game on Steam. It was new. It looked really interesting, so I wanted to check it out. Um, this looks like a game I'd do a full Let's Play on, honestly. It does look really cool, but I guess we'll find out if it's good or not. Alright, subtitles, English, English. Great, that looks fine. I guess we could put this a little bit lower. Go on. Go on! Alright, The Town of Light. It does look like it'll be a creepy game. All of this looks fine. Alright, fair enough. Wait, where was my field of view? Oh, that's that's fine. We're going to go to 92, just to be difficult. Alright, start. The Town of Light is based on real facts and places, as well as a long documentation concerning mental illness and the life of patients in lunatic asylums from the beginning of the 20th century until their closure. It contains stories which may be disturbing, we advise... It contains stories which may be disturbing, we advise its use exclusively by public of adults. The characters and names are imaginary, and any reference to people who may have really existed is, is entirely casual. This game uses an artistic interpretation of a former Italian psychiatric institution for dramatic purposes. Please note that mental health services have radically improved. If you think you may have psychological problems, please refer to a specialist. There's some good advice, guys. Alright. Do this! 90%. Here we are. Volterra, 1942. What's happened? What kind of place is this? Maybe I'm dead. I can't see any light. I might be dead. I can't get up. What's going on here? What's happening to me? There's no one here. Yet, these noises... God, my head is killing me. I can't... Keep my eyes open. Spooky. Reality fades away and my skin is gone. Every breath of wind is excruciatingly painful. All right, the moment of truth. Will this loading screen work? It went a lot faster this time. That that makes me feel it's a good sign, but this please wait. This motherfucking please wait. Don't you dare ruin this for me, please wait. Yes, we're in, we're in, in spite of real facts and events. Sorry. I have like trust issues with Steam games sometimes because so many times they just break. Like, what's the one? DGU. I was really enjoying that game, but it would break all the time. And now it's, I couldn't, I can't get it to work at all now. I haven't tried in like two weeks, so maybe I'll try. All right, cool. We're in the forest. Back to Firewatch. No. Oh. To open, close, use. All right. Simple. Oh, is there booze in there? Let's see. We can turn off. Definitely not taken care of. All right. There go. I have to turn on flashlight. I guess we don't really need it, but it does make me feel a little better. Ooh. Can I grab the shovel? Can't grab the shovel. But can we grab the wine? Can't even get to the wine. Alright, that's fine. We probably shouldn't turn up anyways. Radio! Alright. I sort of turned it on. Oh no, I didn't turn it on. Those were the flies from the fridge. Excellence in story and storytelling. Oh, did they put a award for one of their games? For this game or like in the past? Because if you put an award in your game first off, unless they already got this award for that game, <laughs> that'd be kind of like, well, I gave myself the award because I know I'm going to win it. It could be a past game or it could have already won that. All right. All right. What is, there's a fence there. I'm guessing we're probably enough to break into this. And we'll do so. But there's still uh, stuff over here, and I'm gonna try to go back here. Oh shit, the playground. Someone push, push me. I don't even care if you're a crazy person right now, or a ghost, or I, I just don't care. Someone push me. Oh man. 
Oh, that doesn't work right. That doesn't work right. Unless we're- unless we are dead, and in a dream, then I guess, you know, our weight wouldn't cause us to drop. Maybe that's important, maybe it just doesn't work. Oh, oh wait, I can push myself! I'm doing it, you guys! I'm swinging for the first time! I need to swing soon. Swinging is actually really relaxing. There's something about it that's just great. So much hype at the swing set as a kid at school. Except for those stupid little kids that'll count for you. And I understand, you know, they want to turn at the swing too. But like in my school, if you were on the swing and you wanted to turn, you would just sit next to the person and count to like, I don't even know what it was. Maybe it was like 60 seconds or something. But some of these motherfuckers be like, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I'm like, motherfucker, no, you better slow the hell down. I'm not getting off this swing. I'm going to slap you in the face. I never said that. I never got into unneeded altercations at school. But I was thinking it. So Volterra was what it told us on the, uh, can we pray? On the, um, intro screen. That's where I get in. Can I crouch? That's not where I get in. Uh, here? Yeah? Is there a door? There's a door. Alright, I'm just gonna go through the door. Was there keys in that door? That was a hand. Alright. Is there weed in here? There's a shopping cart. Close enough. I like shopping. I actually do like grocery shopping. I know some people like hate it, but I do it. I really like it. I don't know why. It's just kind of fun. Unless you don't want to go out. Then I get it. Okay. I've got to be missing something important, right? I feel like I am. Oh. Little frame droppage, lag, whatever. Not really lag. Um, okay. So this is pretty much just gardening stuff. Shoot, I think we do actually have to get through that way. Unless we can ramp this. Ramped! <laughs> can we ramp these? Go on, ramp them. Can I see something shiny over here? No, I'm imagining things. You know how it is. Oh! Fuck that! Ah. LKA.IT Presents Town of Light how the game looks so far. I like that the store opened for me. Thank you, sir. This place. Time. Memory. Alright, what the shay? Synopsis menu. Experience, memories, medical records. No documents yet. Alright, so we have to find all that stuff. Staff. Sorry, something wrong with me. I just woke up from a nap. Oh, I'm creeping in. There's a wheelchair right there. What is that on the wall? Oh, it's an eyeball. Let's get in this place. Let's explore. Here's a doorway. I'm gonna let myself in. I don't think that there's creepers like you would have an outlast in this game. But I'm not 100% sure. I think this is more of like an exploring game. 
But hey, I could be wrong. If there's a random creeper... <gasps> That's a medical record right there, probably, too. Alright. Aspidale Psyche... Alright. I don't think it is important. It's not important. But, this is a lot of records. There's no power of the master switch near... Is near the um, calm women ward. Okay. There's something. Whoop. All right. The uh, oh, <laughs> death certificate for pace, and I was like, it's announcing someone's death. But they had the English right there, so. Not the exact English, though. English. Document admitting, readmitting a patient. Okay, okay. Looks like they had some respiratory issues. What about that? No. No. All right, let's go see if we can get um, the power on. Hope to find the calm women's ward. The only thing I remember clearly is Charlotte, my doll. There's the power, I think. Yeah, tranquil. All right. Um, boo -boo 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 -boo. touching buttons. Touching buttons. Buttons. Well, I mean, it should work now. The spaces are scary. Did I just hear something? Or is that just me? I thought I heard, like, a knocking. Does this work now? I mean... It's a start. Alright, it flickered on and off. Let's not waste their power bill, even though I don't think they're paying anymore. Observation area. No, no, she's freezing. She's alone. Let's look for her. Let's Renee does Charlotte. not want to abandon her. Oh, it's locked. Lights. Mouse. Oh, God. Sorry. That's chipping me out. All right. Cool eyeball. Very cool eyeball. It's locked. This is definitely not locked. Anyone? How? It would have been so scary. Like, what if there wasn't even a creeper there, just someone peeing? I would have, like, been like, oh my god. That would have been terrifying. Even if they weren't mean. Or, or meant to be scary. It would have been terrifying. I guess you would hear them peeing, though. So it wouldn't be a surprise. Right, this. Is there any documents? Nope. This room sucks. Piano. In the upstairs area. Before we go there, let's make sure we check all of these. Okay. Just chairs. Gotta make sure. Nothing in the chairs, like, just placed in there. Okay. Ooh, fuck. Well. It is not forbidden. Let's search Let's find the Charlotte. on the f Whoa. Let's find Charlotte. She is alone. She is in the dark. It's locked, too. Alright. Alright. 
Let's go upstairs then. If my mouse, my mouse doesn't like this game for some reason because now I can't move it at all. Let's unplug it, plug it back in. Maybe, maybe not. Should I just plug in an Xbox controller see if that works? Please, mouse. Why is everything working against me playing this game? Is it a sign that I should be paying attention to? I don't know. But we're going to keep trying to play it. If something else happens, maybe I should stop. Oh, great. My Xbox controller. The steering wheel controller. Does my mouse work? Oh, of course my mouse works once I get the controller. Oh, do you guys just ever have issues upon issues upon issues? I'm taking the elevator. Unless it's locked, then I probably won't. Is that locked? I'm lazy for the stairs. Ooh, and there's something in there. Nothing I can use, though. Alright. Take me up. I'm a little scared. <laughs> this rusty old sketchy ass elevator. Fall to my death. Worse, like fall to my injury, serious injury, and then slowly, painfully die. All right. Ooh. Police document committing someone to a lunatic asylum. All right. <gasps> Charlotte, is that you? Mummy took good care of Charlotte. She tucked her in, hugged her, gave her cuddles and kisses. She was very affectionate and loving. Nothing bad happened to Charlotte, and I was amazed. I did not understand. At first, I was quite afraid. I feared that she wanted to hurt me. I was constantly expecting the moment when Mum would abandon her. Because I did not deserve to live. I did not deserve to be loved. Huh? Alright, well we've got Charlotte now. It's cold, it's dark. Now she's cold, she'll get ill. We can take care of her, it's not forbidden. Charlotte is a good girl. Can I use one of those? Alright, now we're on chapter two. Ooh, long to learn about tongues? Holy shit, dropping that knowledge. Well, that's as close as I can get. That doesn't look right. That doesn't look right there. I mean, maybe it is. I'm not a dentist. <gasps> oh, my Elizabeth. Wow. Sorry, I just don't like looking at a nose like that. No. Man, the human body is crazy. What's next? Hit me up with this knowledge. Oh, hell no. Oh. Uh, uh. Oh. 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 Whoa. How long does this thing go? Oh my good, there's there's no more. No what it's like a cleft lip? Alright, I need to go. Hope you guys got that knowledge. I just I I think I hold Charlotte the entire time. I don't think I can put her away. But we should probably get these keys. Charlotte, don't you think keys are important? When all this shit's been locked? But it's not important. So never mind. I cannot pick those up. So we're just gonna go, Charlotte. Let's go. Locked. Damn it. Turn all the lights on. Ah, oh, shit. Ah, oh, shit. 
Charlotte, why did you do this? This is all your fault. More tentacles. There we go. Some light. Here's the document. I feel like I can't click that though. Charlotte! Alright, so this is just a recap. No documents yet. Do to do. Okay. I cannot pick up that document with Charlotte. Can I like, place her down? Maybe where we found her? No. Alright. Wait, did I open this medical thing? Oh, I didn't, but there was nothing in there. All right. I saw a wheelchair on the ground floor. It's a convenient place, and we can get Charlotte into a warm place. All right, we'll do that then. All right, so we got to go back downstairs. Then I'll come back here. I'm taking the stairs this so time. I think it's actually quicker. Oh, this is so much faster than that elevator. All right, it was over here. Sorry, Charlotte, you need to wait down here. You'll be warm. This is a comfortable place for Charlotte. But it's cold. No, no, it's cold. Don't shiver, Charlotte. The cold will go away. I mean, she looks like she has chap skin. We'll find you lotion, Charlotte. Don't even worry about it. Can we go up the stairs with this? Well, Charlotte, first we have this shitty room and this shitty room that didn't have bullshit in them. And then straight ahead is where I found the power that I turned on. We need know. to find warm lights. Let's go into the surgical ward. Right, the surgical ward? Where's that? Where that at? Okay, I did not go that way. Come on, Charlotte. Why Let's are you fucking take Charlotte with me? into the surgical ward. There are warm lights there. Alright, alright, alright. We're, we're going to. Calm down. Alright, I can't read it. There's warm lights over here, though. Alright, there's just random glass breaking. Is this it? Oh, Charlotte. Actually, I think we need the elevator for Charlotte. All right, Charlotte, hold on. You stay right there. I'm right here with you, baby. Oh, wait, shit, hold on, Charlotte. I actually have to let you go again. I need to open the door. All right, it's here, Charlotte. We're on our way. God damn it. All right, Charlotte, sorry. I'm apparently stupid when it comes to doors. Really stupid. All right, there we go. Let's go, Charlotte. Hopefully you fit in here. Oh, you do. So do I. And back. So I grabbed you again. What's that say? Go. <laughs> really, I was having really fun <laughs> rolling Charlotte around. I don't even know why, but it was fun. All right, here we go, girl. Fashion your seatbelt. You're dealing with a woman driver. Even if it's just a wheelchair. Gotta be careful. I'm a lunatic. Alright, the surgical ward. It's not this. Let me find the surgical ward. You stay here. Aw, oh, Charlotte. You're blocking my way. What if we looked and she was just not even there? Okay. 
Realgy. Partially agitated women. Gynecology. Surgery room. Oh, yeah, it's quite bright lights in there. Let's go. I found where you're going, Charlotte. Road trip. Road trip. Get out of here. Sweet. Making my way downtown. Oh, Charlotte. Oh, wide turn. Any creepers in here? The cold goes away, you see? What? The light. Warmth. We can do it. The cold goes away. It's not forbidden. Hmm. Now we can go to that ward where everything started. Alright, you're safe, Charlotte. H to receive help. Oh, so can I get in injured? It all began in the observation ward on the ground floor. Oh, help, like, not surgery help, like, not medical help. Help in the story. So, observation room. Ground floor, right? It's... Oh. It's over here. I hear noises. Yep. And I can open this now and apparently a lot of light. Aw, oh, shit. I can't turn. I can only go straight. Cool. I like the doors. God. I want to run through the hallway. Close them all real fast. Oh shit, that's not good. YOLO! <laughs> oh, never mind. I think there's something wrong with the observation room. Just a guess. I guess it's not really a room, it's just the observation area. But we're also most likely having some uh, mental issues, so this is just, this could be perfectly normal for us. But I miss Charlotte already. There's the beds. Like we're on the ground now. Oh, wow, that's really bright. That is really bright. And the beds are elongated, sort of. afraid, always afraid, a fear that wore me down. I needed help, but I could not speak. Everything terrified me, even thinking. They said they were taking me to a place where the fear would go away, where I would get better. I stopped living in there. They dragged me away and tore off all of my clothes. Every last stitch. I tried to explain what was going on in my head. They tied me to the bed for days. Alone with my nightmares. It wasn't fear anymore. It was madness. And when you're mad, you cease to exist. Wow. Yeah, I mean, if you want to um, read about some really crazy, horrible stuff, read about institutions. Back in the, like it said in the warning mes message at the start of the game. Oh, wow. Hello. 
She was my only hope in this hell. I was falling down amongst the damned, but that woman and her smile kept me alive. See, now this is scary to me. Not like Outlast where there's some weirdo fucking running around. Ugh. I mean, I get he's mentally, but this is like, this seems more realistic and it freaks me out. The door is locked from the outside. Oh, fuck. Here, the doors can only be locked and unlocked from the outside. Oh. Someone come to let me out. Thank you. You want to hang? Anyone? Hang out? Can we creep on wherever this person went? Should I grab those keys when I had a chance? Charlotte, is that you? Nice, in the light. Charlotte, did you let me out? Charlotte? He has Charlotte. Oh, man. Oh man. The walls. What the? Is he bathing her? Charlotte? He laughed, panted watched over me. It hurt when he touched me. I thought I'd split apart suddenly with a loud thud, shattered into pieces. I felt fragile, sick, dirty, filthy. All I could do was clutch Charlotte tightly while he... Rene obeyed. He was the boss in the realm of light. I was devoured by the evil I had done. I threw up and could feel hell getting closer and closer. My god, those medical examinations. The doctors said there was something inside me, which they would have dragged out of me. My god. Alright, chapter four. It's getting dark. Whew. Really sad. <laughs> 